Did you know that the words you speak hold the power of life and death? Every sentence you say can build unshakable faith or destroy it. In today's study, we'll uncover the incredible impact your words have on your faith and your future, and why mastering them is key to living a victorious life. The tongue has the power of life and death, and those who love it will eat its fruit. Written by Solomon, this verse is part of the wisdom literature in the Bible. The Proverbs emphasize the practical ways in which one can live a righteous and fulfilling life. Here Solomon is highlighting the weight of the words we speak, not just as casual expressions but as powerful forces that shape reality. Words can uplift or tear down, create trust or sow doubt. They influence how we see God, how we perceive our circumstances, and how others respond to us. Solomon warns that those who love the power of the tongue either for good or evil will experience the consequences of the words they speak. The power of words. The phrase, the power of life and death, shows the enormous impact that words have. Words can bring encouragement, healing, and peace, or they can cause discouragement, division, and destruction. Think about the times when a single word of encouragement gave you hope, or when careless words wounded you deeply. The Bible teaches that our words are far from neutral. They create outcomes. Eating its fruit. This refers to experiencing the consequences of what you speak. Words create outcomes whether positive or negative, and you will eventually live with the results of what you have spoken. If you consistently speak words of faith, hope, and positivity, the fruit you eat will be peace, joy, and strength. But if your words are filled with fear, doubt, and negativity, they will manifest in a lack of peace and turmoil in your life. How Words Shape Your Faith the Bible teaches that faith comes by hearing. What you speak not only influences those around you but also shapes your internal belief system. Speaking words of doubt and fear can weaken your faith, while words of hope and confidence in God can strengthen it. Consider this, when you declare God's promises over your life, you remind yourself of His power and faithfulness. Words like, I trust in God's timing, reinforce faith, whereas words like, nothing good ever happens to me, chip away at it. When you say something repeatedly, your mind begins to believe it. By mastering your words and speaking life, you're building a foundation for unshakable faith, especially in challenging times. The words you speak determine the direction of your faith journey. Speak life over your circumstances. In moments of uncertainty, instead of focusing on what's going wrong, declare God's promises. For example, if you're facing a tough situation, you can say, God is my strength and my refuge, rather than dwelling on the negative. This doesn't ignore reality but rather aligns your words with God's truth. Use words to build faith in others. One of the most powerful ways to strengthen your own faith is by encouraging others. Speak words of life into someone else's struggles. A simple statement like, God is with you, can uplift their faith while also reinforcing your own. Proverbs 16 verse 24 says, Gracious words are a honeycomb, sweet to the soul and healing to the bones. You have the power to heal and encourage others with your words. Eliminate negative speech. Identify areas where your words have been more aligned with doubt, fear, or frustration. Make a conscious effort to change this by replacing negativity with declarations of faith. When you catch yourself saying things like, I'll never overcome this, replace it with, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Words are not just sounds, they are seeds. Every time you speak, you plant seeds that will grow into the reality you live. 
Speaking faith-filled words doesn't just encourage you, it has a profound spiritual impact, aligning you with God's will and purpose. Imagine the unshakable faith that will grow when your words are consistently planting seeds of hope, life, and truth. The power to speak life gives you the opportunity to rise above and build your faith stronger than ever before. Your words can change the atmosphere of your life. Start mastering them now. What words have you been speaking over your life? Take a moment to reflect on how you can start speaking words of life and faith. Amen. Thank you for joining us today, and we look forward to seeing you in the next study, so make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss the next video.